We are doing everything we can to stay in a good mood during the outbreak and stay at home. A lot of us turn to music, so we thought it would be a good idea to Skype with musician and author Mark Malman about his book, Happiness Playlist. Mark, thanks so much for joining us here today. Yeah, of course. Yeah, so Jason and I actually talked about this a while back when we were talking about the power of music and how it can make you happy. And we said we should really have Mark back on the show again to talk about your book. Talk to us a little bit about music and just the happiness it can bring. Yeah, I mean, it was uh, it, it's a it's a good time for this, <laughs> actually. Uh, I, I I had been dealing a lot with panic anxiety, and I made a playlist of happy music, and I decided I would do an experiment. I listened to it for about six months straight, and I, I noticed that it had a it had a, a an uplifting um, vibe to my whole attitude. It really changed your life uh, just listening. And, and did you listen to this music day after day? How, 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 what was the prescription, if you will? Well, yeah, for the experiment, you know, I was writing a book about it. So I wanted to have a hook for the book. And so, yeah, I listened to it exclusively as an experiment, as a musical experiment, unless I had to compose, which is my job. I'm a composer. So that I had to break the rule. But other than that, I just listened to, you know, the songs like, um, I love music, you know, songs that are, are just make me dance. And there's songs that like a lot of, <laughs> yes. I think, especially like hipster music nerds would maybe uh, turn their nose down mm -hmm. on, on some of these songs. But right? you didn't. You didn't do that. Yeah, I'm, I'm a hipster music snob for sure. But what I recognize <laughs> is that it has different functions. You know, music, you, music you, you might listen to intellectually like a, like a hipster music snob. But also you might put it on to go running you might put it on at a dinner party. So why not just put it on sort of as a meditative mood booster to give you that like five to 10% kick that you need mm -hmm. in the morning. I mean, so a lot of the songs were like Pharrell's Happy or songs I wouldn't normally listen to uh, that that went against my ethical code as a musician, <laughs> but it helped my mood when I needed it, you know, when I needed it. Oh, what are some other of those songs on that list? I mean, like the bare necessities, um, mm -hmm. sung by Van Morrison, and it stole me to my soul, and um, of of course, happy, <laughs> which says happy like 48 times in the song. <laughs> uh, but you know, it, it it works. And that's the key, right? Like in a time like this, this is no time to like hang on to your your snobbiness, and uh, unless that is a vehicle. To happiness mm -hmm. to you, but there is yeah, something. Yeah, I mean, there is that idea of catharsis. Some yeah. people feel stress and they need to put on some stressful music and blast it. I mean, it's something everybody does. You get in the car, and we're not in the car anymore, so we're at home. So our habit, our musical habits, our day-to-day -day integration of music is different. So, making a conscious playlist that you're going to put on and making conscious decisions mm -hmm. to incorporate music throughout your day in this new lifestyle. It, it kind of has, it, you kind of have to do it actively and not passively. So what do you recommend for people? How to choose this list? Is it really just the songs that make you want to get up and dance? I feel like dancing, for me, the thing about anxiety and a panic attack is it's counterintuitive. You, you don't try to figure out what caused it. You just try to get your mind off of it. Divert your mind. Stop your mind from thinking. So for me, uh, yeah, dancing, music that makes me move, music that makes me smile. Uh, music that makes my back relax if I'm thinking about a time. I pay attention to my body because I can use my body to like avert the stuff going on in my mind. You know, yeah. the news is driving me crazy or, or my stress of my job composing is driving me kind of stressed out. My body like doesn't know that, you know? And, and so if I'm dancing, it, I, it's really that simple. Yeah. If it moves you, it moves you. <laughs> exactly, exactly. It's the true. book is called The Happiness Playlist. Mark, uh, I love the book, and I've been using your uh, your playlist as well during all of this. So thanks <laughs> for really being with us. It's really great, you know? Yeah, yeah thanks Thank for you. being with us.